pedigree dogs have always been popular, and remain so today. One unusual breed is the Chow Chow. Its main feature is the blue color of its tongue, as if the dog ate blueberries. Representatives are cute and fluffy in appearance, with a fairly malleable disposition, as well as, with its own pros and cons. The Chow Chow is the oldest dog breed that originated in Mongolia and northern China. In these countries representatives of the Chow Chow breed have existed for more than 2,000 years. The original purpose of these dogs was very versatile, hunting, guarding, deer breeding, and sometimes they were even used as sled dogs. Today, they are more of a decorative dog, but with proper training, they are likely to cope with their former functions. Chow Chows are very loyal dogs. They are very loyal to their owners, and they also treat their homes responsibly. Chow Chow would consider a stranger to behave quite aggressively, especially on its territory. At the very least, it treats strangers with fear and mistrust. Dogs of this breed are balanced and independent. They are very restrained in demonstrating their emotions, they don't whine or jump for joy, instead of wagging their tail you can only notice its slight wagging, and the muffled growl as an expression of discontent. How to care for a chow chow are not too fastidious, its fur is combed once a week and washed not more than three times a year. Feeding is possible as a specialized feed. And natural food. It doesn't need special activity, it is clean and feels good in the apartment, but you shouldn't refuse long walks at least once a day to keep your dog healthy. Chow Chow Pros Beautiful dogs Dense skeleton, mane like a lion, unusual color of the tongue, all this is sure to attract the attention of others. Furry Chow Chow look like teddy bears, which you want to stroke and scratch all the time. Modesty in food Representatives of this breed can eat as dry food, and food that the owner cooks. In this case, of course, you should not feed the dog food from your own diet, especially, if it consists of not enough of healthy food. Loyalty to the owner. Chow Chow, even without security training, will rush to defend itself if it sees that the owner is in danger. Also zealously he is ready to protect his home from uninvited guests. Low need for activity. Though the dog looks big enough and seems to feel crowded in the apartment, in fact, it's not. Chow Chows are lazy enough, they don't feel a strong need for constant serious workouts and four-hour walks. No serious grooming is required. Chow Chow does not need a haircut, combing is enough once a week, and washing is only a few times a year. They do not form tangles, claws are sharpened on their own if walks are long enough. Restrained and quiet. Such a dog almost never barks or whines unless there is a serious reason for it. If he and his owner are not attacked, he usually does not pay attention to other dogs or people in the street. Clean cut. Chow's coat is dirt repellent and also cleans itself of dirt. Even if the dog has been in a puddle, after a while he will be clean again, even if he is not washed. Chow Chow Cons Chow Chows are very distrustful and wary. If they are not socialized enough, they can be aggressive toward strangers and small children. Also, to other dogs. In order to reduce the risk of aggressive behavior, your young puppy should be exposed to other dogs and people as much as possible, and he should be taught to react calmly to them. The dog is quite willful. It is not easy to teach him commands, and if he does, he will make sure that his owner is persistent before he does them again. If you let him slack off, the chow will quickly notice it, and it will be even harder to get him to do something next time. Not emotional enough. This dog is not likely to happily jump up and down to greet his owner from work and wag his tail tirelessly when he returns. He will most likely step indifferently into the hallway and wait to be petted in greeting. The owner needs to be strong, strict, and kind with the puppy at the same time. You can't show weakness with him, otherwise he will try to take the leadership position in the family, and the owner in the house should be a man. That being said, there is no way to be aggressive with a puppy, much less to beat him, 
as he will either flatly refuse to obey commands or retaliate with aggression. He is prone to allergies. Chow Chows are not fastidious about food, but sometimes it adversely affects their skin and fur, as a result of allergies appear bristles and bald spots on the body. So sometimes you have to work hard to find the right food for your pet. Myopathy, which is hereditary, often causes serious complications in Chow Chow, up to and including death. This disease is characterized by a gradual loss of muscle tone, it becomes difficult to run, walk, hind legs move by hopping. If these symptoms occur in a Chow Chow, you should immediately consult a veterinarian. Lack of activity. This dog is not suitable for people who want to introduce the dog to an active lifestyle, he will not want to run after cyclists, go on long hikes or perform long swims. In addition, excessive physical activity can lead to the deterioration of the pet's health. Conclusion Chow Chow is suitable for people with a measured lifestyle, for whom high emotionality is not the main indicator of a dog. It is a beautiful breed with its own characteristics. Only the owner can decide which of them to consider as advantages and which as disadvantages. Are you thinking about getting a Chow Chow? Let us know what you decide in the comments below. And if you know someone who's thinking about getting a Chow Chow, please share this with them. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Otherwise, have a great day. Thanks for watching.